The film Parasite, released in 2019, portrays the story of a Korean family who is struggling to make ends meet. When a family friend tells the son about a job opportunity tutoring the wealthy Park family, the Kim family set up an elaborate scam through which they all get jobs working with the Park family. When the Park family are away on a camping trip, the Kim family discover a dark secret in the house, and the plot intensifies from there. On the surface, this film presents a reflection of and a commentary on class structures and disparity. The Park family, with their large open floor plan house, designed by a famous architect, is presented in sharp contrast to the crumbling basement dwelling of the Kim family. The Park family is presented as extravagantly wealthy, to the point at which they just throw money at their problems in order to get rid of them. Yet, although wealthy, they're not presented as particularly sharp-witted, given that they have no idea of the deceptions which the Kim family is carrying out against them. The Kim family, on the other hand, while clearly destitute, are presented as very skillful and intelligent. Yet, Parasite goes further than just a mere reflection on the differences between rich and poor, or the inequality that exists between different classes. More fundamentally, however, the film explores what people will do in order to survive, and in an effort to preserve themselves or their family. In some ways, this theme has become kind of overused in film in the past decade. Yet, despite its frequent appearances, it still remains an intriguing concept, perhaps because of the number of ways in which it can be taken narratively, while still remaining realistic. However, there is an element of concern about how such a theme is presented. It is clear throughout the film Parasite that the Kim family are the protagonists, because the entire story is centered around them. In many ways, also, they are presented in a very sympathetic light, no matter what kind of atrocities they may commit. There is a sense in which the narrative of the film attempts to almost subconsciously justify what they're doing. While the family begins by committing simple acts of fraud and deception, they end by committing very egregious acts of abuse and even murder. And these are presented within a framework which appears to imply that the crimes they commit are justified because they're poor, and they're simply doing what they need to in order to survive or protect their family. Even at the end, after the father of the Kim family has murdered the father of the Park family and is hiding in the underground bunker, the film pushes you to sympathize with him, or at least respect him, and root for his escape because it's good for children to be reunited with their parents. From a more technical perspective, the cinematography of this film was at times very masterfully carried out. As the film begins rapidly moving towards its conclusion, there's a scene in which the Kim family's old basement home is flooded during a thunderstorm. The manner in which the sequence is edited juxtaposes the flooded basement with the prisoners and the underground bunker. The shots cut back and forth to illustrate the similar circumstances of both situations. In a particularly powerful moment, the son stands holding a heavy rock in his hands, while the light above him flashes on and off, signifying his wavering between light and dark, good and evil. There was also a certain type of shot composition that was carried out several times throughout this film. The framing would place one character in the background of the shot, with another in the foreground, often because the character in the background was attempting to observe the character in the foreground unnoticed. An argument could be made that this particular type of shot composition encapsulates the story of Parasite, in which various individuals, specifically the Kim family and the couple in the basement, attempt to hide in the background of the Park family's life, both in a literal and metaphorical sense. Despite certain morally troubling elements of its plot, Parasite is overall a very masterfully produced film. The cinematography and the narrative pacing serve to make it a captivating story that is well worth watching. Overall, I'd give it an 8.5 out of 10. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe for more movie reviews and commentary.